My name is Paul Joachim. I'm going to show you how to move your primary domain at your web host from the default uh, root inside public HTML into a subfolder. So I have logged into cPanel here at Arch Hosting. Here's my primary domain, my name. I will go to File Manager. And inside public HTML, we have uh, various folders. I have not placed a full website in here because there's a lot of files and folders and it will really mess up the public HTML folder. So instead, I've created a subfolder and I've added the website into it as you see here. So first, I need to go to settings and I'm going to show hidden files like so. Click save because we're going to modify HTML, HT access file. So I click it, I can click copy here, or I can do a right copy, right click, and then copy. So I'm going to copy that into the root inside public HTML. And here we have the HT access file. I did some research and I found code from web host that uh, works. So I'm just going to copy this code and place it into this HTF, HT access file. So click edit then edit again and I'm going to replace what's there and just paste this in so it says change your domain com dot com to be your main domain so that is then Paul Joachim Rumdal. so I'm going to copy this and put it as the name of the subfolder also subfolder there and then my main domain dot com so basically what it says here is going to uh, point the main domain into the subfolder with the same name here that I made so save changes so right now when I go to paulyokinrumdal.com, we see the subfolders. And inside here, I then have the site. A test site I made with the Beans WordPress framework. So I have logged in. There are two ways to make the change. I can make the change directly through WordPress settings general and change the uh, URL of the WordPress address and also the site address or I can go back to cPanel and go to PHP my admin locate the database go to VP options and just change the values directly in the database so that's what I'm going to do right now click go and the same here to home remove the subfolder and go so these are then uh, just pointing to the domain okay I'm just gonna refresh here and it boots me out and I'm gonna log back in It's a little bit slow going here, so I'm going to inspect, right click, inspect, and then empty cache and hard reload. Because that is very likely affecting, so I'm not able to log in for the moment. So we're going to try this again.
So we see a change here up on top, and let's see here. Okay, we're going to go to the site. And let's see if it works. Okay, it's coming up here and also clicking the logo brings to the front page to the main domain. So we're going to try logging in again. And see if I'm able to log in this time. Okay, it looks like uh, it's almost. It looks like it's almost working, and uh, it can be a little bit slow going, as you see right here. Okay, we're going to try login again. Okay, we're in. It, as you see, it's a little bit quirky or it, it is a little bit stubborn and it can take a little while, but just keep on going as I did right here and it should work after a little while. Just be patient and just try to log in a few times as I did. You can see it's corrected here and it looks like it's working as it should. Thank you.